Hello, my name is Mark Pimentel. I'm a CAM application specialist here at Hawkridge Systems. And in this video, I'll be showing you some of the top new features for CAMWorks 2023. So as one of the world's top CAM softwares, CAMWorks is always trying to improve the user experience and the functionality of the software. So this year they've added a bunch of new features, but in this video, we're just gonna cover one of the top ones and that's gonna be how to program multiple materials in a single assembly mode. So previous to 2023, you had the ability to add multiple parts to a single assembly, but you had to define it with one material type. You could define individual stocks, but they had to be made out of one material. Now in 2023, you'll have the ability to define each individual part with their own individual material definitions. So let's see how that works inside the software. So as you can see on screen, I have two parts in this assembly. The first one being made out of aluminum and the second one being made out of steel. If I click on the stock manager, we can see that they have their own individual stock shapes. And if we go into the stock manager, we'll see the new functionality in 2023. And that is the ability to define for each stock shape their own material type. So for this aluminum shape, we have 6061 being defined. If I click on my second bounding box, my second stock shape, we can see that this, this stock shape here is defined as 1018 steel. So the purpose of the material definition is for the use of the TechDB. If we go into the operations, we'll see how that actually comes into the part. So for my aluminum part, using this rough mill operation for this open pocket, I'm using in my feed and speed tab, I'm defining it by the material library, which means then when it recognizes that this is 6061 aluminum, it now calls a certain set of feeds and speeds associated with that material type. If we do the same for the second operation, the one being applied to the steel part, again, we'll go into our feed and speed tab. We'll take a look at it as being defined by the material library. And since we define the material as 1018 steel, it now calls feed and speeds associated with that material type. So now in CAMWorks 2023, not only do we have the ability to program multiple parts in assembly mode with their own individual stock shapes, we can now define those individual stocks with their own material definition, meaning that we can carry over that automatic nature of CAMWorks overall. We can inform the fees and speeds based off of the material type using that material library definition. If you want to see more of the new features in CAMWorks 2023, click on the link below in the description to view the recorded webinar. Thanks for watching.